So talk about how you're pulling and how many how many you're pulling and how you are pulling referrals. Because I heard you say this the other day. I'm going like, dude, I'm an idiot for not doing this because it just it would have just made my life a little bit easier because yeah. you got guaranteed appointments and you're you're somebody you've already helped is essentially vouching for you. Definitely. And they know like they know what you're coming to talk about. And right. Even though these people do know where we're coming. But you, you never get to the door. Sometimes Elise can say, well, what is this for again? Right. 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 You know, like I helped your cousin. She saw what I did. I go over who I am. Lay down. Lay right? down. But um, so and I thought about it this way. Right. I'm like some of the best agents, some of the best producers have come from a, a referral. Sure. Most of them. You can get that same deal just in, in the form of an appointment. Wow. And these people want to make more money too. Right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, um, you know, a lot of my best team players are from referrals. Right. Yeah. So, um, so yeah. So when I'm in the home, the first referral that I like to get is the beneficiary referral. That's what I call it. I kind of named it. Right. <laughs> so the beneficiary referrals, I mean, lay down. Right. So sure. you get their why. Okay. They know exactly who they want to leave the, you know, the money to to take care of their final arrangements or, you know, whatever else is going to cover. Sure. And then I say, OK, perfect. I said, so here's what I'm going to do. And I stop right there, right as I'm getting that beneficiary. Even sometimes before you do the application or in the process, if you forget to ask in the beginning, you get to that part. Right. OK. So I'll say, listen, uh, Jamie, you listed Jamie as the referral, right? As okay. a beneficiary. I mean, as the beneficiary, I'm sorry. No worries. Perfect. So here's what I'm going to do. And I tell them what I'm going to do. I'm going to call Jamie, right? And I'm going to let her know the process and the steps on what she needs to do and who she needs to contact, which is myself, Okay. when that time comes. Does that make sense, Frank? Yeah. Okay, perfect. What I'm also going to do, I know you don't really maybe know her financial situation, uh, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to make sure she has the same information I was able to bless you with. <clears throat> How does that sound? That sounds fantastic. Perfect. That's my first referral. So that's like automatic. Automatic. And when I call, I always like to, I like to edify people because yeah. they forget the negative things that they're about to say to you because they don't know you. So I hurry up and edify them like, and they're like, they're in, in happiness. Yeah, and bliss. Right. So I'll call and let's say you're the, you're the sure. beneficiary, right? Yep. Hey, Frank, how you doing today? I'm good. Who's this? This is Corinne. I didn't mean to call you off guard. I'm sorry about that, but I just want a moment of your time. So my name is Corinne. Um, I'm one of the brokers here um, with FFL. I was able to sit down with uh, Jamie. Do you know who that is? Yeah, I do. Okay, perfect. So we spent about five to 10 minutes talking about how great you are. Said you're responsible. You take care of your kids. You're a hard worker. All those things true? We talking about the same Jamie? Yeah, we're talking about the same Jamie. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. That's that's me. Okay, perfect. I was able to sit down with her for about 10 to 15 minutes and actually go over an affordable plan that worked out for her and her family when it came to life insurance. Okay. Now she's not sure of your financial situ situation, but she did want to make sure that you had that same info because she loved, trust, and cares about you. Wow. Okay. So it takes about ten to fifteen minutes. Um, are you you're in the Prince George's County area? I am. Okay, perfect. So I'll be in that area tomorrow. I can swing past and just take about ten to fifteen minutes to go over that with you. All right. Sounds good. Perfect. Now, are you married or single? I'm married. I tie it all down. Tie it all down. Let I'll, me ask you a question. Mm -hmm. What if I were to say? I've already got life insurance. Do you push back at all? Um, no. So I'll just say not a problem. That makes my job a lot easier. Okay. Right. It'll only take about five minutes to make sure you have the proper plan in place. When's the last time you had somebody look at your plan? Hell, when I, when I, when I got the plan. Yeah, not a problem. I did the same thing when I bought my insurance. Right. Okay. Um, but I made some upgrades because I found out there's more information out there that I didn't know about. Would you agree? Yeah, absolutely. Perfect. Absolutely. So look, I'm not here to sell you anything you don't need. And I'm not here to add any, anything to your plate. What I'm going to do is review it for you, go over it with you. If it all works out, it makes sense. Great. You're, you have the best plan possible. Okay. But if I see some flaws, right, we're going to have a quick chat about what's available to you if you're interested. All right. Sounds good. Perfect. So that's money. Yeah. <laughs> and then two, they're leaving me with referrals. <laughs> it's just a never ending It's a never ending. I'm cycle. getting referrals from referrals and sometimes I'm getting 10. I don't stop until they're like, okay, that's enough. And okay. they never get upset. No, they don't. No. They don't. People, and, and it's just like when you call them at 7.30 in the morning. You get the agents that go, well, that's early. No, most people are up getting ready for work. Yeah, they and you know they, they appreciate that call earlier. Later, they just want to relax. If you get one referral from all 30, that's 30 extra free leads. But you're getting more than one. I'm getting like 10, 5 to 10 per person. 
so how do you get past all right i understand the beneficiary one that's easy right i was going to go to that next yeah one. okay yeah, let's okay. do that because I'm, I'm i'm interested in this one okay so you're a client right yes. I've, I've closed you already right yep all right frank so here's what i do right i also run my business off referrals as well right so here's the deal you have three to five family members or friends that you talk to on a day-to-day -day basis is that correct sure okay how hard would it be right because now you got your life insurance right you're all set you're also paying bills and trying to take care of your family you're maybe even trying to save some money is that right always how hard would it be that if your three to five family members or friends did not have this information and they passed away how hard would it be to support their gofundme or maybe even dish out money to help them for, with their final arrangements on top of taking care of everything that you have going on yourself. It should be really tough. Right. So no matter their financial situation, hey, Frank, they could even already have life insurance. I just want to make sure they have this updated information. All right. So who do you love, trust and care about your top three to five people that you talk to that you want to make sure they have this information. So when that time comes, you're not left trying to dish out extra money on top of what you're already taking care of yourself. Okay. Right. So like, who's Bob? Bob is your cousin. Is Bob married? Kids? I quickly do kind of like a little. Sure. So I know Background. what type of yeah. intro conversation to have. He said you have two kids, two girls. Now, he didn't tell me too much information. Right. What he did say was that you take care of your kids and you're responsible and and how important you are into his life. And he's like, oh, my God, when can I sit down with you? <laughs> <laughs> so I'm like, and go, who's next? Who else comes to mind? Who sure. else comes to mind? Right. Yeah. And then I'll tell them what I what I'm going to say to them when I call them. Right. And you I'll tell say, a client. I tell the client. So I'll say, if they're a referral already, I'll say, look, I, I'm, I'm going to do it the same way that I did for you because all this information is true, right? You are that type of person. Yes. If they're not a referral and they're a client I got from a lead, right? Here, this is what I'm going to say when I call them. I'm going to call Jamie. I'm going to I'm going to let Jamie know all the great things you said about her because you obviously you wouldn't put her down if you didn't trust her. Right. Right. And I'll say, look, I sat down with Frank. Uh, it took about 10 to 15 minutes to go over an affordable plan with his family that he's extremely happy about. He wanted to make sure that you had that same information because he loved, trust, and care about you. And then I'll see what state are they in. And then I, I even have clients that say, do you do people in Florida? Do you do people right. in Florida? So I'm grabbing licenses. Licenses as you need yeah, them, I just yeah. had to get a Kentucky one because my one of my referrals, her daughter and her husband live in Kentucky. So I have an appointment with a married couple over the phone in Kentucky. You know what? And, and <laughs> you know what I can say about you is you're you're extremely passionate about what you do. 